Good morning, everyone. It is smoothie time. We just went to the gym. My hamstrings hurt so much from yesterday. <laughs> it's so sore to stand on that angle. We worked out um, back, shoulders, well, I did, and some cardio too. So today we're having this keto smoothie. Oh my god, is this my new favorite? Mm. The caramel with the blueberry is so good, which is random because I thought vanilla would be way better because I did vanilla last time, but caramel just, it's just the icing on the cake. I need some more. <laughs> it's like empty. It's such a pretty color too. Nice little minty smoothie. I just walked into my drawer handle. How? Nest is that? It hurts so much. It's not bleeding. It's like under the surface bleeding and here too. Look at that. Ow. I'll show you what I walked into. I walked into this and I don't even know how because it's like tucked away. I must have like got real close. And then that one just went tink, over the edge of it. Never done that before, but there you go. That looks so painful. It's going to film a freaking clothing haul today too. I might still do it, but Everyone will be like, what's on your leg? Looks like lipstick. I am about to film a cooking video for my Instagram, So Fit. Um, so if you hear Chipmunk talking, I'm just talking in there. But I thought I would just speed it up for you guys because you guys love this. so good let's do a mukbang not an actual one but let's just chat i can try anyway i don't feel like i'll be able to get my camera high enough for you to see everything so the other day i went to wellington and tried on wedding dresses and i don't know i was really nervous because i'm the kind of person where sometimes i can have 50 50 when i go to try on clothes sometimes i'm like oh my god everything looks great and then other times especially if the lighting's bad i'm like everything just looks bad do you know what i mean so i was kind of nervous i was going to go for my first dress try on and just hate everything but i filmed it and surprisingly like i loved almost every single dress i put on so it's made me so enthusiastic and excited for the wedding process now like i was kind of dreading it like and it's nothing to do with like my body or anything just purely like i just didn't know if i'd look good in a wedding dress the lion's bit over here oh my god mm. If you hate mukbangs and chewing noises. Oh my god, already guys as well, my leg muscles are popping. Like I've done a few leg days since starting my challenge. Um, doing different like feet positioning to normal. Like usually when I do a leg press, I just did like the standard leg, pr leg press. But in my plan, they like tell you how to do everything and show videos. And there's like a low feet together leg press, a high feet apart leg press. Just a regular high leg press, regular wide reg leg press, like all these different leg presses. And it was targeting like areas of my legs I didn't even know how to target before. Like my hamstrings, like I keep saying. 
like the sides of my legs like my bum like all these areas it's so good and literally like when you touch my legs they feel hard no every time i sit up here and eat louis cries okay you know what i'm way too awkward to film this right here so i'm gonna eat i'll be back later oh, how do i get this louis come here come here louis bear Come cuddle me. Come here. Dickhead. Oi. Look at him. He's so smug ignoring me. Come here. You're such a dork. What are you doing? Who are you looking at? Huh? So, I put up my... I feel like my eyelash is falling off. I put up my cooking video on Shinexo Fit. So I spent my afternoon doing that. It's uh, quarter past five. This page right here, Shinexo Fit. I'll try to focus it in case you don't follow me there. That's what it's called. We hit 50k, yay. Um, so yeah, I spent some time doing that. I got all my emails done. I got some more filming done for an IGTV for Shinexo. I took some cute photos. I don't know why this is not focusing. So Hamish is picking up the groceries and then we're going to put away the groceries and then have a chill night. Maybe walk the Dio... Why did I just say that out loud? He didn't notice. W-A-L-K. The D-O-G's. Come here. I'll throw it. Do you want me to throw it? He still loves his goat and he still has not ruined it, have you? You'd be very nice. Louie and Zeus are both due for their yearly vaccination top up and teeth checkup. I reckon that Louis is going to need some more teeth removed because he's got the Italian greyhound genes where their little gums get all dry and their teeth get all gross. Don't know. Louis going to fuck off at me. What? You're going to bite me. You're going to bite me. You would never bite me. Um, Zeus got his teeth deep cleaned midway through this year, I'm pretty sure. I'm sure I vlogged about it. He had one tiny little weird tooth removed. Just like a little wiggly one. He's quite old now. I think... How old are they? I think Zeus is eight. Is he eight? And Louis seven, I think. Would that make sense? Or is Louis six and Zeus is seven going on eight? Maybe he's turning eight. I don't know. Anyways, in dog years, they're getting old. So, just need to make sure we're on top of it. Their teeth checkups and everything. But yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if Louis needs some more out. He's just got effed gums. Pure breeds, everyone. Fake tan today. It's finally starting to develop nice and dark as well. So, tomorrow I might film a clothing haul. Or I might do it on Friday. Kind of want to do it tomorrow, I reckon. And then maybe Friday I'll just have like a chill day editing. Um... Because I've got like heaps of packages. Bought some workout gear from Cotton On I thought I could try on. Some stuff from White Force Boutique. I got some stuff from Miss Lola. I got sent some stuff. I got like I purchased some stuff as well. There's just a big mixture. I'm like oh well I might as well film a try on haul. Because I haven't done a clothing video this year yet. And I like to do them pretty frequently. But I do want to do some more um, subscribers buy my. Well not subscribers buy but subscribers choose my outfit videos and maybe some more boyfriend chooses my outfit videos so just before I do them I'm like I might as well just do like a little collective clothing haul and show you guys what I've been buying lately um just like casual clothes dressy clothes and workout gear so yeah hopefully you guys like that that's all I've really got to talk about today I've got so much energy and nowhere to release it right now I'm just like I'm in like a real annoying mood, you know, when you just feel like annoying people. That's me right now. I love the way this foundation melts into my skin throughout the day. This is the new Urban Decay one. First impression going up on my channel tomorrow slash by the time you see this vlog, it'll already be up. Um, the new Urban Decay foundation, go check out my Shanexo channel, but throughout the day, it just... And I filmed an IGTV of the rest of the makeup, including like an under eye setting powder and stuff. So yeah, that'll be up on my Instagram soon, because I haven't done IGTV in a while. Maybe I'll go do that until Hamish gets home. Just do some editing, because I've just got a lot of 
brain function still left for the day. <laughs> By the way, this top is cotton on and I'm wearing these leggings from the Peach Builder. They're really flattering on the butt. <sighs> <sighs> Is definitely enough. Look. Yeah, and it's just favorite. lettuce this time because their iceberg lettuces have been really gross lately. Oh real? Yeah like you know how you get the white ones? Yeah. And it's just rank. So hopefully this is good. What's the stuff? Can I try one of these? Yeah. Jalapeno cheese. Is it going to be spicy? Is it low carb? It should be. Good point. Yeah, less than one gram per serve. Truck. Do you want to try one? Oh, God, that did not look satisfying though. I could do burgers one night. Can you how that's on our plan? Yeah. That jalapeno cheese would be so good. Jeez, there's a lot of coconut cream in here. I just want Biden next week. Just making Hamish some lunch for tomorrow so that in the morning he can just grab it and go. Just using a little bit of the bacon fat in the pan, heating it up. That is left over from the bacon I literally just cooked two minutes ago. I'm steaming the veg. I'm going to mash them with um, 15 grams each of cream. I mean, not cream cheese. Feta, creamy feta, rather than um, butter. Usually, the plan calls for butter, but I felt like mixing up a little bit today, so I'm going to do yeah feta instead. Macros might be a bit different, but. I reckon it's going to be super tasty. Top ups of our favourite. Bon appetit. Bon appetit. Bon appetit. Bon dirty feet. Just took off my makeup because my eyes are still real sensitive from hay fever. Um, and I don't want to wear makeup any longer. Oh, it feels so good. <laughs> Stop laughing your own joke, it's fucking me off. <laughs> myself making my magnesium drink right now. <laughs> I hope you can't hear it in the background. <laughs> I've been trying to get this like bottle of iodine open for like two minutes and I just realized there's a plastic seal on it. Formula to support healthy thyroid. Iodine is an essential nutrient for the production of body's thyroid hormones. One, two, oh! Alright, I just want to show you guys something random. 
that I've noticed. All right, so you guys know how I've been using Genora. It must have been for like, I reckon it's like well over a year. Well, well over a year. So the top layer, like up here has gotten so much thicker and I've really noticed it because look at that like bottom six inches of my hair. It's so much thinner. And it hasn't broken, it hasn't fallen out. Like that's genuinely just how thick my hair was. Like I've just got so much more hair growth. And also I reckon I lost heaps of hair when I came off the pill and it's all like growing back in. And like I've got so much hair up the top here, like this real thick hair up the top. It's like top layer. So hopefully by the time I get married, in another year from now, I can keep trimming this. And hopefully this thickness will continue to work its way down as I, you know, continue to grow my hair. Like it's like crazy, it's like literally like a layer. Like I could hack all that off and it would be so luxe and thick, but I refuse. So what I've just been doing lately, like if I want my hair to look spectacular, so like most days I don't bother because I'm just at home, but like if I'm going out, I'll just put in literally one track of my clip in hair extensions, or maybe two if I'm feeling very fancy. Just like a track, just to like thicken up the bottom layer so it doesn't look as like thin. But yeah, my hair was looking so thin for a while, like it still looked great and healthy. And I feel like thin's not really the right word, but now it's just like thick, thick, do you know what I mean? Like compared to normal. So that's amazing. Like I've just got so much of it. It's the best. I'm trying to decide if I can change my hair color, like to a more like honey blonde, but I can't decide. Like I'm kind of feeling like it's very blonde at the moment, the lengths. But then some lighting, I love it. I just can't decide. What do you guys think? I really want to go brunette eventually, probably after my wedding, because I want to be blonde for my wedding. And I don't really want to wear a wig on my wedding day, just because I'd be paranoid about it, like, pinging off or something the whole time. So I'd rather just use my own hair. What do you guys think? That's what I need to, to do tomorrow, is edit my wedding video too for my main channel. I'm really excited. So tomorrow I might film a clothing haul, but I might do some editing in the morning. Um, put up my beauty video, then film a clothing haul like I talked about earlier, and then just go back and edit all of those exciting videos I've got coming. So, big day tomorrow. It's almost 10 o'clock, probably just about. Yeah, it's 10 o'clock on the dot. So, I'm gonna go to sleep, and I'll talk to you guys tomorrow.